Now, today, for some reason, our inbox was brimful with bizarre-sounding stories. There was the plan to hold an international surfing competition at Eden Park. Plus a proposal to give preschoolers basic training in how to be lawyers. And something weird with jelly. We thought our reporter Adam Hollingworth's no fall, so we sent him out to investigate. There's something purple and wobbly going on here. Parakai, gateway to the west. We don't actually come here that often, but we've been told that there's an amazing story lurking behind these walls. It's got something to do with jelly, and we're here to find out. Yes, Parakai Springs announcing on social media they filled their pool with jelly, thanks to the local Foursquare. He did us a great deal on bulk order of jelly, over a million packets, and overnight our staff cracked into it. We put them in the pool, we dissolved it overnight with our geothermal water that we have here, and today we have a pool of jelly. Sunshine's not a friend of jelly, so we pitched in. We were lucky enough to get, obviously, their last two packets, so um, if you like, oh, this, this can help anything you. Anything will help. We need more gelatine. More than a 1,000 people responded to the post and seven-year-old Elaine came to taste it firsthand. It was fun. I could bounce in it. And when I went under, I ate a little bit. Oh. And it tastes like raspberries. 65 years ago, the BBC reported on a vital crop for people in Switzerland. The last two weeks of March are an anxious time for the spaghetti farmer. There's always the chance of a late frost, which, while not entirely ruining the crop, generally impairs the flavour. And today, a Hamilton legal firm put itself in the dock. So we're really proud to offer the first formal lawyer training programme for preschoolers. Courtroom etiquette, how to handle legal documentation, appropriate office attire and many other subjects. So much for the baby beaks, not even the baby blacks would have anticipated this. Some of these legends like Dave Gallagher might be turning in their graves, but there is a serious proposal to turn Eden Park into a surf break. Not a Mexican wave, but a chance to participate in the World Surf League tournament. Eden Park reception says it's been inundated with calls. After all, the Romans once flooded the Colosseum to stage a naval battle. I've been to the cricket, loved it. I've been to the rugby, brilliant. But surfing here in the Garden of Eden, I just can't see it. Ah! Adam Hollingworth, News Hub.